here in the i button and in the description box below you will get complete playlist of partial differential equation welcome to a new chapter that is partial differential equation and in this particular video we are going to see the definition of a partial differential equation and some very basic points regarding this topic okay so let us start a differential equation containing one or more partial derivatives is called a partial differential equation okay yes i am using this short form of partial differential equation that is pde okay a differential equation containing one or more partial derivatives okay what is derivative and what is partial derivative okay if somebody is written like d okay like d is z upon dx okay d z upon dx it means we are finding the derivative of this z with respect to x but if we are using partial derivative it means we are using this form del z upon del x instead of d okay instead of d we are using del okay where can we use okay why do we use this del okay now let us see that point partial differentiation okay partial differentiation occurs when only when there are at least two independent variables okay partial differentiation occurs only when there are at least two independent variables okay that is when z is a function of x and y okay here we have uh, two functions that is x as well as y okay so if you want to find the value of z we must have the value of x and y okay these two x and y these two are known as independent variables where this z is known as a dependent variable okay because z the value of z depends on the value of x and y as the value of x and y uh, changes the value of z also changes okay so we can say if z is a function of x and y then z is a dependent variable and x and y both are independent variables fine okay let us take one example okay let us say we have z equals to x square into y okay let us suppose we have z equals to x square into y okay so here if you want to find del z upon del x okay if you want to find del z upon del x okay it means we are partially differentiating okay you can say we are differentiating this z partially with respect to x okay we are differentiating z partially with respect to x it means we are keeping this y as constant okay so this y will be as it is and since we are differentiating this z with respect to x so this x square will become 2x okay so del z upon del x for this z equals to 2x into y okay this x square will become 2x and this y will be as it is okay similarly if you want to find the value of del z upon del x okay similarly if you want to find the value of del z upon del, del y okay del z upon del y it means we are keeping this x as constant okay so this x square will become as it is okay now again since we are differentiating partially with respect to y so this y will become 1 okay so x square into 1 will become x square now we are coming to a very important point that is order of a partial differential equation the order of a partial differential equation is the order of is the order of highest order partial derivative okay present in the equation okay we need to find the uh, highest order partial derivative okay in that equation and that will be known as order of the partial differential equation let's suppose we have two examples for order one how it is order one let us see yes here you can see x del z upon del x plus y del z upon del y equal to zero okay here you can see yes the order of this del z upon del x is what one because we have differentiated partially z with respect to x only once okay similarly if you see in this term we have differentiated z partially with respect to y okay in this particular term the order is one and in this particular term the again order is one so yes for this complete equation we have order as one okay now coming to second example of this order one how it is order one again you can see we have differentiated this z with respect to x partially okay yes we have differentiated z with respect to x partially okay once only once okay this is the power of okay this is power 2 okay that is del z upon del x power 2 okay but we have differentiated this z with respect to x only once so order of this term will become 1 
again if you see the order of this term will again be one okay so order is one in this term order is again one in this term so we can say the highest order okay the highest order partial derivative present in this particular equation is again one okay now coming to second that is order two how we can say this is order two yes here we can see this is del square z upon del t square equals to k square into del square z upon del x square plus del square z upon del y square okay here we can see we have differentiate this z twice twice with respect to t again if you come to this term we have differentiate this z twice with respect to x again z is differentiate twice okay partially with respect to y okay here partially with respect to t partially with respect to x partially with respect to y twice here twice here again twice differentiate partially again here z is z is partially differentiated okay with respect to y twice okay so here the order is 2 again here the order is 2 here again the order is 2 okay so the highest order partial derivative present in this particular equation was how much 2 so we can say the order of partial differential equation is the order of highest order partial derivative present in the equation okay this is the example for order 1 this one is also an example for order 1 and this one is the example of order 2 now after this we will come to the degree of a partial differential equation okay so the degree of a partial differential equation is the is the power of highest order partial derivative present in the equation okay highest order highest order partial derivative present in the equation highest order partial derivative okay here the order is 1 here the order is 1 okay yes since both order is 1 now the power of this del z upon del x is how much 1 here again del z upon del y power 1 here you can see del z upon del x okay del z upon del x power 2 here power is 2 here again del z upon del y again power 1 so if you see highest order partial derivative here the highest order partial derivative in this equation is 1 okay and the power the degree of that okay the power of highest order partial derivative here 1 again 1 so we can say the degree of partial differential equation for this particular equation is how much 1 but if you come to this equation okay but if you come to this equation okay the degree of a partial derivative uh, differential equation is the power of highest order partial derivative present in the equation here you can see the order is 1 in both the terms but but here you can see the power is how much 2 okay in this particular term the power is how much 2 so we can say the okay here in this particular equation okay in this particular equation the degree of partial differential equation is how, is how much 2 okay the degree of a partial differential equation is how much 2 now again coming to this order to example that is del square z upon del z upon del t square equals to k square del square z upon del x square plus del square z upon del y square okay now here the power is how much 1 power is how much 1 power is how much 1 okay so we can say since all three terms okay since all the three terms order is 2 okay the order to the order in all three terms are 2 okay but in all three terms okay whose order is 2 the degree is 1 or you can say the power is 1 so yes so we can say in this particular equation whose order is 2 degree is how much 1 because this is power 1 this also power 1 this also power 1 so in this particular case the degree of a partial differential equation is how much 1 okay now after this we will come to a very 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 important point that is last point partial derivatives del z upon del x del z upon del y del square z upon del x square del square z upon del x del y del square z upon del y square are denoted by p q r s t respectively it means if somebody is written like del square and del z upon del x we can denote that by p del z upon del y can be uh, denoted by q del square z upon del x square okay can be denoted by r del square z upon del x del y can be uh, denoted by s del square z upon del y square can be denoted by t respectively okay so keeping all these things in mind we will come to the first topic of a partial differential equation that is formation of a pde okay from next video onwards we will see the first topic of this 
our chapter that is formation of a partial differential equation. Okay, thank you so much.